Greetings, person currently watching this, and welcome back to Fight the Dragon, as well as welcome back to the channel. Yeah, I know I've been uh, gone a very long time, and I figured what better way to welcome myself back, and welcome you back more importantly, than to play an old fan favorite, and also to see what has changed since I've been gone. Uh, let's see... Hmm, wasn't there... Oh, guess there wasn't. Eh, who cares. Uh, this square. I like that one. We'll just do a quick random adventure, you know. Yeah, so... First off, I'm, you know, sorry I've been gone a long time. Oh, hello. I probably should have read that, huh? Ah, whatever. We have found it. The Mine of Ages. A city of legend is said to have been buried here in the mine? So, oh, hold on. Go forward, adventurer, and see what is beyond this gate. So, did you guys build the city and turn it into a mine? Or was it like a mine and then you guys were like, hey, you know, we... Already got all this space dug out. Let's turn it into a city. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? I mean, I guess we'll figure out when we go inside, but, you know, it just would have been, I'm just saying, it would have been nice if you would have told me before I went inside. You know, some things you can just tell a person and I'd have to make them figure out for themselves. There are two perils in this room. If I was to guess, I'd say opening that gate has something to do with putting them in those two rooms. I heard some creepy noises ahead, though, so why don't you go? Uh, sure. I mean, oh. You, uh, how you guys doing over there? You, uh, just chilling? Oh, they're rats. Yeah, you just totally caught me by surprise. Oh, why am I using my tomahawk thing? Give me a mace. Just beat you with a mace. There we go. Alright, so. Oh, can I? There we go. And, no, I didn't want the barrel. Let's open these up. But yeah, sorry I've been gone so long. Turns out, uh, you know, trying to straighten out your life is... It's not a, a quick thing, you know, it's not like you can just go buy a couple energy drinks, you know, throw on your workout playlist and bash it out in the course of a weekend. No, it, it, it takes some time. I mean, I'm still working at it, but I figured I've been gone way, way too long. So, I'm going to try and do both at the same time. Alright, you're just going to sit here and bug me, so we're just going to go ahead and take you out right away. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, now I'm starting to remember the stuff that happens in this game. Um... Like how easy it is to die. Alright, there. And then we take care of you, unless I get stunned. Yeah, I, I... It's it's like slowly but surely, it's all coming back to me. And yeah, I'm starting to remember stuff like that. Like getting stun locked by lightning creatures. And the fact that your character is actually a lot more squishy than I remember him being. Okay, so that's the pressure plate, I'm guessing. So you... You come over here. And go right on top of this. Excellent. I may as well take this potion. Because I don't think there's a checkpoint room in here. Nope, doesn't look like it. Alright, you come with me. And I'm sure there's going to be baddies in here. So let's go ahead and just charge in recklessly. Take them out. There we go. Yeah, okay, I was about to say. I had a feeling your guy could, like, hit multiple enemies if you position him right. I just didn't remember if, how. I didn't know if it was, like, a special ability or not. There we go. I'm going to leave you alive. And dead. Excellent. Okay, so we got some stats. It doesn't... I don't know. I haven't read... I should probably just read the patch notes. If anything, that's probably what I should have did before jumping in headlong. But, you know, that's not my style. I like to rush in recklessly and try to figure out, you know, figure out things as I go. So I didn't read the patch notes. If anything, I'll probably read it after this. Oh. Hey, you think you're clever, huh? Yeah. Forgot that I had the ability to jump. Yes. Come on. Just die. Please. And then for you... Oh, okay, it's a sneaky little guy. That's not gonna save you. If anything, it just assures your doom, because now you're just in the lava. Oh, oh, you're gonna be like that, huh? Ah! 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 No! Ah! Help! I'm on fire! Um, uh, rage! Rage! That that gave you a uh, regen, right? Unless they patched it away. They didn't patch it away. Oh, thank goodness. I'm so glad they didn't patch that away. And now for you. Come here. Uh, you, no, no, no getting away. Nope. You're just gonna... Uh, die again, just like all your friends. I was gonna say he was just gonna die, but, you know, he's kind of already dead, so I'm not... So, does that mean he's super dead, or... Because, like, he's, you know, because he, he's already undead. So, or is it... How does that work? Is he just, like, was he resurrected, so he was dead, then he was alive, and now he's dead again? Or was it, like, he was so dead that he came back to life, and then I made him even more dead, which made him less dead. You know what, I'm 
I'm just gonna hit things. <laughs> you know what this? Yeah, I'll just I'll just go back. I'll just do what I do best, which is just hitting things with a big heavy mace. There we go. That's so much easier than trying to use your brain. There. Nope. There we go. All right. So what is in this room? A uh, room that I can't get into. All right. Oh, hi there. How how are you today? Oh, because you teleport. All right. I mean, it's not gonna help you any. It's just gonna make you pretty much die on low mana. So you know, there's that. Congratulations, you did a thing. I mean, he really should have just waited till I was in there. So then he could... ah, oh, hey, hey, hey now, hey now. All right, we we don't need all that. You can calm it down, a bit. Oh, that really burns. Oh yeah, okay, that's that's block. All right, let's try and take out the little. Actually, eh, I don't know if it'd be better to use my mace or my throwing weapon on these guys because then I'm at range, which is kind of their strong suit. So I think just beating them with a mace. I think just beating things with the heaviest object you can is probably the best strategy for most situations in this game. Here we go. Take care of you. And there we go. Alright, now we help ourselves to the treasure. Yes. Tasty treasure. Ooh! Even bigger hammer to hit things with. That's always a good thing. And then we got these, which I believe, yep. Oh, no, they don't? Did these just... Didn't these used to heal you? I thought those used to heal you. Maybe they used to heal you. Maybe I'm crazy, and I just don't remember this game as well as I thought I did. I mean, it's, it is, it's kind of been a while. So maybe, I don't know, maybe some things changed. Maybe they thought that was too overpowered, you know? As opposed to the ability to have full health regen, as well as, what, double damage? Is I think what Berserk does. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love that ability to death, but... I mean, when you think about it, it kind of seems a bit overpowered. No, 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 blocking ain't gonna save you. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah. Orc guy. Hey there, orc guy. Can I just stand right here and just whack you in the head? Yeah. See? Oh, oh, never mind. He has the ability to walk up small inclines. Uh, come on. I need you to... Ow. I need you to kindly die and get out of the way so then I can beat your friend who keeps stunning me with his little lightning aura. Ooh. Twin daggers, I think. Those twins. I have a feeling they are. Oh, hey there. Oh, you know, maybe I should use some of these. Yeah, whatever that did. Oh, yeah, this is... Yeah, it gives me the ability to stun lock them back, so... That's actually quite helpful. So I should probably start using that against those lightning guys, huh? Yeah, that'd probably be a good idea if I actually... Took a moment to think about what I was doing. Alright. Oh, yeah, those are rage... Yeah, and then rage... Okay, yeah. And then rage potions. That's right, these give me rage instead of mana. Yes, sorry if I'm, like, being a complete and total noob at this. It's, I have no memories of this game at this point. So it's kind of like I'm learning everything afresh. But I do remember bits and pieces. Oh, hello. Jonas, what do you have to say? I failed here before you, adventurer. I will not let the same happen again. Well, aren't you a helpful ghost? So, how do we avoid me dying? When you put those barrels in place, you awaken a great evil. So, barrel summons boss. The key to the way shrine is hidden in one of the old houses. Voldenhar. That's definitely how you pronounce that name. I'm, there's no other way to pronounce it, trust me. Got to me before then. Okay, so the guy's name is... No, no, I don't want to talk to you. I want to open the chests. There we go. Okay, so, yeah, bar plonk down the barrels, guy comes out, beat him senseless, get key, and then key opens his way to crystal, and then crystal helps us leave this palace of death that is also a mine. A mine palace. No, no, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna turn your little thing against you. Oh, wait, you don't have it. No, hold still, little punk. Just hold still, stand, no, stand there and let me kill you. There we go. That's a good skeleton. No, come back here. Okay, um, maybe I should try my other weapon, if I can remember how to- there. Yeah, see how you like it when people throw things at you. Unless you're being blocked by the maggots, that's also a thing. Ah, uh, hurry, hurry! Ow! Well darn. Ah, well, I still got three lives, so three more bodies to throw at these guys. Oh, how did I forget you? Alright, but I still have full ra uh, rage, so if anything, I can enrage. Hold well, on, I'm gonna get my mace back out. I can enrage, because I should get a speed buff as well. So these guys shouldn't be able to run too far. 
and then take advantage of the damage bonus to clear out these slime guys, plus the regen. There we go! Easy peasy. Except for you. You're gonna take a while to die, just because you want to be difficult. But eventually, you will keel over, just like everyone else. And a chest. Just more gold. Okay. I wonder if they've changed anything with that. Is gold still kind of fundamentally useless? I mean, I guess I'll figure out when I... Hi! Hi there! How are you doing today? I hope you're enjoying the weather. Have a nice day! I'm not exactly sure who you were or what you were trying to achieve, but... I hope you enjoyed it. Ah! There's more of them. It's a dead adventurer! Oh, okay. Ah, so you're the Volden dude, but you're a golem. I thought he was gonna be like a skeleton king or something. Oh well. I mean, I'm still gonna beat you senseless, just like everything else, but... Just, I was kinda gearing up for beating a skeleton king senseless, not a golem. Alright, come on. Ah! Get, ad, kill the ads. There we go. Let's get back to pummeling him. Actually, if I can remember it, these guys are like, you can largely ignore the little ones, can't you? I think you can. I mean, you can cleave them just like that, it's no problem. But I mean, I think... Yeah, I think, yeah, they're just... You can just ignore them. It's not like they're hitting you for a whole lot. And you kind of just mop them up when you're done. There we go. Cool. Alright. And a random anvil, because... Oh! Hey there. Um, hold on. Hold on, I'll get the... There we go. Anyways, back to the random anvil. Well, I guess maybe this is supposed to be like a dwarven city? Because that's what dwarves are all about, right? Just like anvils and lava. That's like their thing. Oh, do we have a jump? I see the shadows of a jumping puzzle, I think. And a... Alright, yeah, so, um... Things are happening in this area that are just unexplainable. I mean, it, it'd probably take more... Oh, yep, oh, 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 no, 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 no! Ah! Well, at least it's not a pit of death. It's just a pit of getting your socks wet. Alright, try it again. This time, don't be stupid. Hup, hup. And... One more. Yeah! And it was just a treasure chest. I thought it was gonna... Okay, um, let me see. No, it doesn't look like there's any cracked walls. Nope, nope. I doubt there's a secret down here. Uh, yeah, the secret was death. <laughs> okay, so I'm kind of wondering if that was intentionally there or not. I have a feeling that he honestly didn't think anybody was stupid enough to walk into the abyss. All right, so there's that. Jumping puzzle. So what about this? Oh, hello, there's another room here. Or is this the same room? So we the same room. Can I go in? Yes, I can. Uh, nope, it's not the same room. There's just one next to it. Alrighty, we'll just clear out these suckers. There we go. Excellent. Come on. Get to you. There we are. Alright, and what's in the chests? More gold, which I still believe is fundamentally useless. Another chest inside of you is some health potions. Those are at least somewhat useful. I mean, they're compared to gold, more useful. Alright, so how about in here? Because there was a thing about the... Wait, didn't he... Didn't he say something about two barrels that you needed to summon the golem dude? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, oh, go ahead and just get these, because I don't know how I forgot them. Alright, hold on, hold on. Hey, ghosty to goo. Uh, ghost dude. I need to talk to you because I need to check some things. Let's see, failed... Here, put the barrel... Yeah, see? When you put those barrels in place, you awaken a great evil, but he was already awoken. Oh, maybe because you died? Maybe he put the barrels down and then he died. And then when he died, he didn't have the common courtesy to remove the barrels and reset the trap before he left, you know, before he shrugged off his mortal coil. So the barrels are still on the pressure plates, and thus that golem was just hanging around in here because golems don't know how to move barrels. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what we're gonna go with. Yeah, that's yeah, that's that's that sounds like a plausible explanation for this. Either way, you guys are dead. So yeah, okay. So you're the key. Mhm. Mm yep, gold key. All right. So let's go ahead and just get these last little chests, and then we will head to the checkpoint room. And we will be. Oh yeah, don't even need those. All right. So that's all that taken care of. So now we head to the exit, and we get out of here. Oh, chests. Celebratory chests. Go ahead and get this inside of these. Which isn't going to be much, unfortunately. Uh, is there any over here? Yes, there's one. And the final one. Because I don't think this leads to a treasure room, right? I think this is just... you. This is the exit, right? Yep. Yep, just the exit. Well, that's unfortunate. Um... Yeah, I liked it. 
I mean, other than the whole thing about the guy saying that you needed barrels and there weren't no barrels there, that was a bit odd, but it's not like that's a game, you know, that's not like a deal breaker for me. Alright, so, I'll go ahead and sort my loot, and then, eh, eh, why not, we'll do one more mission, I'll just go ahead and quickly sift through this stuff, you, you guys won't have to worry, I'll just do it off camera. Cave creator, oh hey, Redo made this one. Alright, uh, welcome back person currently watching this. So, I noticed here on the leaderboards, and I kind of, when I was booting this up, saw this, they had this thing called FTD Dreams 17. It was like a content creator. I'll, I'll look in more into it so I can give you a full, so that way I can give it the, like, the description that it deserves, because it seems like a pretty amazing thing. And I noticed that one of these is by Redo. So, I think we're going to do this one. Unless it's part of a series. It's part of a series? Maybe. D1... Oh, no, 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 no. No, okay. I don't think it's... I don't think that's the way it works. Either way, we're gonna do this one, so let's do it. What do we got? Dreams are the place where we can escape reality, and no one can hurt us or control us. Until now. Alrighty, let us begin. Hello, person! Are you here to control me? Hey, mate! This is me, your best dream buddy, Bruce. Hello, Bruce! Man, I'm glad you are here. We've all been waiting. Are you joining us for lunch? Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I don't know, it's just, it's, for some reason it's odd that you just spawn in. There's this, but it is a dream, so. Uh, Rosaline is preparing your favorite. Mullen, what? Mully Gata. Mully Gatani soup. I'm just gonna call it Mulligan soup. I, I hope I'm not offending anybody by doing that. And silence. Oh. Bye, Bruce. I'll see you whenever. Okay, so what do we got? They got a bookshelf. Investigate the bookshelf. All my favorite books are in my mind because this is my mind and we're dreaming. And a clock, what's the clock say? Looks like lunchtime, my favorite time of day. What do we got here? Bib and Bob. All right, uh, let's see. Let's talk to him first. Hey, bro, want to play a bit after lunch? Oh, okay. Again, Okay, I, I'm having a lot of... I'm having difficulty understanding what these people are saying. For some reason, I thought Bit was the name of the game. But he's saying, like, want to play a bit isn't, like, want to play a little. Catch me! Um. Oh. Okay. I mean, I can... Okay, I guess we're gonna go find the goblin, dude. Unfortunately for him... Oh, hi there. Well done. So, was he there the entire time and I'm just stupid and didn't see him? Why do I have a feeling he was there the entire time and I just wasn't paying attention? Alright, well, there's nothing over there. Are you? No, you're Monica. Ah, a beautiful man approaches. Oh! How are you? Got some time for me after lunch? Well, apparently me and Bib are gonna... I don't know, probably play, like, Dynasty Warriors or something. I mean, you're welcome to come if you want, but... I mean, yeah, some kind of... I mean, I guess I could always just hang out with her afterwards, but, I mean, it is Dynasty Warriors, so we're probably going to be at it for a while. Anyways, Bruce, I'm starving! That's good to know, Bruce. That's pertinent information. And you are... I can't see because of the green thing. Rose salt, or something like that. Lunch is almost ready, love. Okay, so what do I do until lunch? Play with the door? Oh. Hey, stay clear of that door, will you? Nope. I'm going to... Oh. You know, we don't know what is behind it. Well, there's only one way to find out. Oh, okay, lunch is ready. I mean, I guess I'll go and eat. Can I eat? Something gonna... What is that? Or what was that? Probably the door. The door. No one ever rang. The doorbell. Pretend we're not here. Everybody put blankets over their heads. In the name of the king, open the door! So, can I open it now? You guys, you gonna keep bugging me about opening it? Because, I mean, I can not open it if you don't want me to. You know, you just... Just say the word and I'll, you know... Not slowly inch my way towards the door. I'm, I'm gonna reach for the handle now. My arm is in the air. It's, you know, careening recklessly towards the handle. About to grip it and let in whatever's on the other... Okay, I'm just gonna do it. Oh! I did not see what that said. Hi there, Harold. What do you have to say for yourself? Are you the dreamer? No, that's uh, that's Bruce over there. You're gonna wanna speak to him about the- oh, I just bumped my mic. You're gonna wanna speak to him about the dreaming. Good. 
To aid the war effort against the undead hordes, the king has decreed that all citizens must work in their sleep from now on. Oh, that's pretty bold of him. Please don't try to stop us from executing our orders. You and all your imaginary dream friends will have to work from today. Follow me. Or I could just wake up and you guys can screw off. Alright, let's just go ahead and see this through. I mean, why not? We're, we've already invested, like, what, two minutes into this? That's, that's quite a lot of time. As you can see, we made some slight modifications to your dream in order to increase efficiency. Your work begins now. Please bring all these barrels to the armory. Oh, uh, sure, I mean... Seems kind of like we're in the world of dreams, you know? It's kind of like everything can be... You know, anything can be done, and this is, this is the best... So is this just a wall of nothingness? Oh, no, it's the next area. Okay. So we go in here. Then we get some more barrels. Then we bring them back over here. Yeah, no, this is... This is cool. Alright. Can I... Oh, yeah, I can't screw with barrels. Alright, so we're gonna be at this for a while. So, um... How's things, person currently watching this? You, uh... Everything going good for you? How, uh... How's that thing of the doctors? Did it, uh... Did it work out good? I hope it worked out good. I mean, as I was saying before, you know, I've been busy just trying to get everything in, in order. I mean, I'm still, there's some still, you know, some things that still I have to get working on, but, you know, in due time. Alright. Hey, Bruce, what do you gotta say for yourself? Hey, lad, I'm glad I finally found you. You see all those soldiers leaving the armory to the real world? It is so many. So are those guys, like, coming out of my head? Like, am I just laying in my bed right now and there's just, like, dudes just popping out of my forehead and just, like, walking out of my house? Or is this just not happening at all? Yet, it seems like we are still not winning the war. And if we are not winning, we will never get lunch. But I have a plan. Can't talk about it here, though. Follow me inside my secret hideout. And where is said hideout? Is it past here? Nope. Where's your secret hideout, Bruce? Oh, that thing. Okay, we'll just head in there. Oh, nope. First things first. Gotta have priorities. Get the checkpoint, get the potions. There we go. Okay, what do you have to say, Bruce? Here we are. Monica and me were thinking about a way to end this war so we could all go back to normal. Hold on a second, please. Sorry about that. Hot fries and energy drinks were not a good combination. Clearly, all the soldiers we are equipping are not enough to win this war. Something terrible must be going on. So we figured that you should go and find out, as you are the only one who can leave the dream. Of course, in your dreams, a second can feel like eternity, so we'll have to speed up the process of waking you up. The only possible way is to see, no, wait, the only possible way I see is to dream a horrible nightmare, so you'll have to wake up. Take the stairs when you are ready. Alright, let's see what horrible nightmares await me. Oh no, it's spiders! Ow! Oh, it's an ambush! Ah, it's me getting the crap kicked out of myself. There! Enraged! There. Yes. Excellent. We'll get through his... I'll just punch through his armor eventually. Hopefully. There we go. And he's done. Yuck. Spiders and slugs. Could be worse, though. Yeah, I suppose. Could be. Yeah, there's, there's things worse than slugs out there. Not, not much, but... Oh, okay. Oh, wait. So is this the end? God, no. This looks way too familiar. This is a rat grinder. Oh, no. It's one of those maps. You know, the ones where they just throw a bunch of enemies at you at once, because that's cool, I guess. Well, I have AoEs, so suck it, rats. Holy cow. Oh, okay. Oh, well, that's that's kind of less cool. I thought what was happening is, is like they were exploding, you know? Oh, hi, more rats. I mean, it's not like I can't do it again, so. But, you know, I thought it was like, um... What is it? I think it's in Diablo 3, the Necromancer. I think it's the Necromancer, maybe it's the, the Witch Doctor. Where he has that ability where it's like, when an enemy dies, they explode and they damage enemies around them. So you get like this really cool like chain explosion effect, especially if you do it against like a large group of low level enemy uh, enemies. Because you can just one shot them anyways. That's what I thought was going on here, but no, it's just like, it's doing several pulses and then they're exploding. I mean, it's still cool, but... I don't know, there's something about having like a chain like that, where it's like, you kill one, he explodes, he kills two, they explode, they kill two. I don't know, it just seems a bit cooler. Finally. God, I thought I would die from boredom. 
Hold on, let me go ahead and grab these. There. At least that way I get something for my boredom, you know. Oh, hello. Dad! What are you doing here, Dad? There you are! You almost missed the party! Did you forget? We have a huge family celebration today! Come! I wasn't done reading that, Dad! Ah, jeez. Just like in real life, always pushing me to read faster and not spend all day... What? Did I tell you about the one time when I stepped in dog... Oh, oh, they're just all on top of each other, huh? Alright, well, let's see what else we have to... Let's see who's around here. And Joy and Uncle Whoever. Grandfather TK. If I ever told you how I fought in the war... Yes, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Nothing important there. Okay, how about over here? Um, what are you guys doing in here? Go away! Can't you see we're smoking? You're going to reveal us. What do you have to say? No, I don't want the barrel! I want to talk to her. Hello? Can... Okay, I don't, get, I don't get to talk to her. I guess she's too good for me. Uncle Thotas! Look at you. Last time I saw you, you were this small! Okay, that's definitely a very, you know, way to contribute to the, the dream world here. Wait, does that say fe- Oh, no, okay. I thought I said feather. But, 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 you... You enjoying yourself? I mean, I know it's a party and all, so I mean, good on you. Come on, dance! Okay, that's what he said. Yeah, dancing! I mean, this this is the closest to dancing I can do, but... Yeah, dancing! Hello, oh, maybe the clock? Investigate the clock. It's still 8 p.m. Time has never passed so slowly. Okay. Let's talk to you. So, how's it going with the girls, huh? No luck yet? D none of your business? I didn't mean to do that. I want to talk to her. I must have been a year since we last met. Do you even remember me? I bet you don't. Okay. Hey, my boy. How's it going? Are you still going to school? No? Haha. <laughs> How the time flies by. Okay. So, is that a no because I'm, like, old enough that I've graduated? Or no because I'm a dropout? And if... You, oh, you're so good. Oh, these two. Yeah, these two. Someone is coming. Yep, I'm right here. Hello. It is I. How's things? We're um playing. Yes, that's it. No, sorry, boy. You can't play with us. Okay, so there's that. Okay, that's good. Oh, maybe over here? How about in this room? The one I didn't check. Maybe in here? Nope. No. Well, here's a trap door, so maybe eventually I have to go in there. All right, let's talk to Grandpa. Maybe he's the one that I need to see stuff. Yes, good, and about that one time, two orcs had me trapped in a corner. Did I say two? I meant twenty. All of them twice my size. Probably with trolls for mothers. Yes, when I was your age, the world was much more dangerous. Anyways, back to the orcs. Yes, stories, things. Get out of here. Yep, toilet. Alright. That's what I thought. To the trap door in here. Maybe? Oh. Hello. Um, there we go. Yeah, finally awake. And what does that do for me? Commander, good to see you. Our dream soldiers are dying. We are losing the war. The circle of the necromancers will be here soon, so brace yourself. All right, I'll brace myself, and by that mean I'm going to get some potions and prepare. Here they come! Or at least they're minions. Wait, so can I just like... Ah, wow, they are really jumping me. Okay, that's why I thought they were right here. Alright, let's just enrage and beat the crap out of them. Because I believe, just like the golems, they can just keep spitting out ads. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just try to... Or maybe not. Come on! I'll get through that HP. It's just the right amount of violence. Come on! Almost there! Or maybe not. Jeez, that took forever in a day. Alright, enrage again, as I can. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and do this, because that should help clear out some of the ads. If it'll let me. Oh, it won't let me because I'm enraged, I think unfortunate. Alright, well, we'll just use up this enrage, and then we'll use this ability. Oh, nope. Alright, never mind. They're already dead. Alright, so I guess I'll clean up the trash. More. There we go. Alright, and... No, oh, hold still. Just be a good little skeleton, and hold still, and tank your lumps. There you go. And now for you. And then once we're done with you, we can finally move on. Unless you don't, you keep doing that thing. Oh, come on now. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 jeez. Okay. That was a close one. All right, go ahead and pick this up. Pick you up. All right. Oh, hello. Boss chest. Oh, hello, what are you? 
Paywall.com? God damn it. I knew I had to make that boss harder. Maybe some extra elementals next time. I mean, I... Oh, oh, I have too much crap. I have too much crap. Alrighty, um... Are you... In, I don't want to... You, like... I really want to sort through my stuff so I can loot you, but... I actually don't want to at all, so... I'm just gonna leave you here. Okay? Okay. Finally, back to bed. And by that, I mean... Leaving the adventure! Yep, 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 all that stuff. And I'm gonna give it a like. Because I did like it. I mean, it probably sounded like I wasn't having fun, but it was actually kind of enjoyable. Especially the whole, like, when they got to the whole mob grinder thing. Because I have, I mean, you guys see that, I, or no, you guys haven't seen, I think you haven't seen those. Fortunately, I saved you guys from those. Um, but when I grind levels on these characters off camera, I do so many of those, and they are mind-numbingly boring. Because it's just you swinging your weapon. And especially with Warrior, if you have Enrage, it's just you swing your weapon and occasionally you Enrage. That, and that's, yeah, that's about it. Because thanks to that regen and the double damage, you'll just mow through enemies and you'll recover all your health. So I'm glad that, you know, they kind of took a jab at those in that. Um, anyways, I think I've been going on for way longer than I intended to. So I'm going to end the episode here. Um, just kind of want to say, like, especially because I, I kind of felt it at the end. I was getting a little... That sound like I was petering out, I know, but you know it's been a while since I've done this, so I'm kind of still shaking off the dust. Either way, I am very happy to be back, and I hope you guys are glad that I'm back as well. Either way, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here. Um, before I go though, I do want to say one thing. There's a game that recently came out, and I am very excited to play it. And I have a feeling that I'm just gonna put everything else like fight the dragons, transmissions, just put all those on the back burner so I can just focus on that game because that's how excited and how much I want to play it. So I hope you'll forgive me going without playing any other games than that for the next while. Either way, I'm going to shut up talking now. I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I did. Bye.